Gemini. Hey, Gemini. That's who we doing today. First out the gate. Somebody want a reading. This is Gemini. I don't care if it's general. It was two minutes. It was five seconds, Jesus. Just give me a reading. Okay. I'm in transcendental mode, so y'all, I may be like a mumble rapper. Because I'm just in transcendental mode. I want to get people readings because I'll be feeling the energy. And I know how that shit feel. When you be wanting to know some shit. And they get it, but not quite. And you're like, damn, maybe next time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. This, oh, oh, for real? <laughs> mm. We used to get to the hip hop deck. But right now, because I'm, I'm just transcendental. Y'all bear with me, okay? I say it's the decks. I'm going to get into this. Gemini power couple week twin flame wedding anniversary celebration week it'll be up Sunday Monday energy checkups back to the normally scheduled program. Three of Swords, of course. The Hierophant, higher forces, higher power, ancestors, angels, fairies, gnomes, unicorns, ducks, shit. Two of Swords, boundary setting. Boston up is like only where to go right now if you're doing what you, oh my God, super, please. <laughs> I was gonna get that hip hop book, but I ain't. You just had to do the reverse. I ain't reading no reversals. How about that? Nah. Right, Nipsey positive. Yeah, you don't do no reversals. Somebody in the valley of decision. Moon goddess energy. I'm gonna just pop some cards and read it as I see, cause it's a lot going on just off this alone. Some of y'all may be confused. Like, what are you looking for that answer? It's not that crazy. It's ground your energy, Gemini. I mean, like right now, you heard me? Yes, sit down, stay in the house, yes. That is a great idea. And order some food if you don't want to cook. Because when I say you're at the three of wands, so you're on a you're you're in a sensitive spot. And the reason I say that is because it's something that's building momentum. It's just starting out. You know? So I don't know if you're starting to see some emotional disturbances. Some of y'all could be in union. A marriage, you know, been with somebody for a minute, now they're starting to show whatever traumatizes them. Because you got to remember, they say it takes, what, three months for a person to show you who they really are? Times is changing. You can't count on that kind of shit. <laughs> you know, whenever the unmasking unfolds, it unfolds. And sometimes, if you're a healing nature kind of energy, the trauma won't show till later because I mean the person feel comfortable you know it's like having some getting some peace after a long time of being in war shit person they feeding off that healing um, high vibrational energy that some of y'all got somebody say yes yes the devil keep wanting to come up, so y'all may be dealing with the Capricorn energy. Well, they got Capricorn somewhere in their chart. Somebody dabbling in some witchcraft, I feel. I'm trying to say, oh, God, he wants to go He did a little split hop up in the air and kick. You already know I'm going to some ugly shit. 
Mm-mm-mm. He a Gemini too. They better not mess with Gemini's that be doing right. He just did a Bruce Lee on Four swords. Yeah, some of y'all go sit down and get some rest. You really need to. Because you're all in the beginning stages of something. I just don't know. I'm trying to get clarity. If somebody that you're with in a power couple dynamic or a twin flame dynamic is starting to show emotional disturbances, and it's kind of triggering you to like all the bad people you dealt with, you know, all the past relationships. It's like, damn. This shit again? Like you've been hoodwinked? No, that ain't it. You just love, you stepping over into a higher level of love. You know? Where you can't judge it. Where, where you gotta live up to the words you be talking about. People, people word is about to be carrying more weight than ever now. You know? So you ain't gonna be able to just be saying shit. Or you gonna have to pay for that shit just to be saying. And not living up to it. Times is changing. I say it's changing. Better, better. These guys do rough ass patches. Emotional disturbances. Somebody may be sleepwalking. If you are, you put yourself for a transcendental uh, meditation or some type of channeling. As soon as I said somebody sleepwalking, they came out. Some people sleepwalk. And sometimes, on some real shit, a person can be doing what an ancestor that is not of the light yeah, is making them do. You know? Especially if they ain't right. Or, you know what I'm saying? It's just, it be all kind of shit going on, y'all. Y'all could... The reason I say that, the reason I say that is because y'all could have left a situation like that. You know? And you don't want to end up in that kind of situation again. And some of y'all are rebuilding your lives. Some of y'all feeling guided to stay with a person that's showing that. Because y'all know that y'all could come out on the other side of it. And it's worth the hurt and the struggle of keeping the union together. And some of y'all are being guided away from something. But you in the beginning stages, so it's kind of like you don't want to make any rash decisions. It's not that you're, you know, undecided like you're not going to decide. You are. You just don't want to make any rash decisions. As far as like, it feel like, like, yeah. Like y'all, y'all got a vision. Some of y'all just got a vision. Some of y'all are real family oriented and highly creative in tune and you're emotionally balanced. That's why you're able to catch these emotional imbalances in people. And they say it's you. Sometimes. Some of y'all feel those type of energies. Y'all either walked away from it or y'all feel like they're worth, you know, fighting for it, basically. It's just not a lot of unclear energy like you're not clear yeah like, yeah like you want to be single that's what prince is saying too because every time prince and two chains come out in the same energy it's like they're saying something but in opposite ways if that makes sense Prince came out first, so you're trying to figure out, do you want to be single? Do you just want to stay single? Or like a confirming, that's what I wanted to say. After heartbreak. So it could, it could not, it could not necessarily be a person per se, but just, do you want to be with somebody, period? Or do you just want to stay single on some Prince shit? You already know. Uncle the who? He was not about to be. Oh, mm -mm. He wanted. He wanted to try to be regular, like family, children, wife, man. But no. Some people just ain't cut for this shit. Some of y'all may be going through that. Will of Fortune. Mm-hmm. The tide about to turn, so y'all gonna come into some form of clarity, and y'all gonna have some boundaries. People having boundaries on people. 
as far as like stuff you used to let get off or stuff you wouldn't speak up about, you know, that people do. And it really be them crossing your boundaries just because we slept together or just because we had a good time or whatever the case may be. Even if we have children together, it doesn't matter. You still got to have a certain amount of boundaries. People know that that are in um, healthy marriages. But I'm talking like friends with benefits type of stuff. So y'all on that too. Like, man, I can't do this shit. Gemini energy, some of the women, yeah. Male and female Gemini energy out here. Do I just want to be a hermit, be to myself, raise my kids, be done with this shit? Because there's a lot that comes along with it. That's how y'all feel. So, like, y'all might even be saying who is even worth it and can't think of nobody. And if that's the case, y'all gonna fuck around and that's when you're gonna manifest your twin flame. I'm telling you. When you give us the ghost on shit and you really don't give a fuck, you, be like, you know what? I'm about to let this shit go and just live my fucking life. This ain't get tan either. Another Gemini. Run out of patience. Temperance. Like, you know what? I'm just about to run this shit around. That's like when you lose some shit. And as soon as you stop looking forward to find it. Some of y'all sticking in there. Some of y'all decided on that shit. Just wanted to come out. Y'all just love the person. And what the fuck? That's your life. And then y'all asking is y'all ancestors giving the fuck? No. But they saying do what you do. You know? If you're strong enough to handle certain shit, do what you do. Especially if you love the person. They're worth hurting for and you can withstand the hurt. You know how to make a, 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 a snake dance. And you know how to dance. And don't nobody get hurt too bad. Based off of whatever trauma you have and whatever trauma they have. And you you gonna keep walking through them dark tunnels. That's what it's about. Some people are crazy, like like some people, some Gemini's I'm picking up, like Uncle Prince. I don't wanna be bothered with it at all. You know what I'm saying? And then some people like left eye energy. Burn down the house. But she still was ready to go, you know, she still wanted to be with him. He was the one that couldn't get past that. <laughs> this is how bad do you want it? How how enduring is is your love for real? You're not about to endure with somebody you don't love. You just not. You can't fake that shit. Just like B couldn't fake it with Jay. People can call you dumb. He cheated on her tonight. Man, shut up. You should not know nothing. You just be talk. And be sitting up here getting cheated on, know it. People just be talking, trying to tell you. That's why you can't get caught up in people. You really can't. Tupac is like, oh my God. Somebody won't make their mind up. Tupac getting aggravated. King of Pentacles energy. Y'all may be done with the Capricorn or King of Pentacles energy, Virgo or uh, Taurus that won't make their mind up. And that's what y'all like. You know what? I'm about to get the fuck out of here because I'll be done. Yeah, you don't want to end up with one of those, you know? Y'all may be picking that up. I mean, everybody got that inside of them. It's the old, it's, that's the old program. Turn you into something else. We don't let that shit go. Justice. Some of y'all going to be coming in a union. If you're in separation from a um, Capricorn energy or a Capricorn that got a Gemini in their chart, and you're a Gemini, or you're cross-watching, or whatever the case, Capricorn energy is heavy on this breathing. You can have it in your chart, Gemini. Either, either way, people have important placements with uh, Gemini and Capricorn in it, and somebody is going to come back, and y'all are going to get married. The person you be impatient waiting on. They see how strong you are. They know they would be a fool to sit there. They, they know I'm about to do that. But they also, I'm also feeling the same energy that I channeled previously of somebody trying to make the right decision. They just sick of making the wrong decision. It's not that they aren't going to decide. They are, they just don't want to make the wrong decision. But sometimes you can just wait too long. You know, but that'd be fear restricting you. But you gotta let people work through their shit. Ace of Pentacles, money, blessings, new day. 
reward for patience, Virgo vibes, watch out for haters, growth, winning, and it's time to invest. Okay, so if y'all are building anything right now, I would advise you to, not I, when I say I, it's I and I, spirit is all, so don't get caught up in that. When there's no separation. So sometimes I'll say spirit, sometimes I'll give a specific energy that I'm feeling heavily, or I'll say a specific person because I know the energies because this is my family for real. <laughs> I don't just be saying that shit. Not about the ancestors I've been working with because uh, well, they work with me through some dark shit. But anyway, it's time to um, simplify. So if, yeah, if you're building an empire, you know, and sometimes we get bored because we act like it ain't nothing to do. We got three energies out here like this. Some people surrender into love. They really are. They just are. All of these are surrender poses. One woman, one man. Uh, healthy, build a healthy household, you know, in whatever way that we paint a picture of how we want to heal and do better. This is a submission. Just give up, you know. Ain't nothing to hide. Arms wide open. What you want to know? Let's talk about it. Maturing. What the twin flame journey is really about, for real. <laughs> possible transformation. So somebody is going to transform. You know, it's just it's possible, and they're going to do it. <sighs> but simplify. You know, you just simplify your inventory. Simplify. Your, uh, if you got reference books you done created, if you got whatever ideas you have, simplify, simplify the best that you can. Simplify your budget. You know, if you're in an esoteric knowledge, then make sure you put that in your budget. It's a part of magic. It's just what you do. But only buy reference guides right now because everything... And when I say only by reference guides for you, personally, this is what Uncle Bobby is showing me. Buy what resonates with you right now. Don't get caught up in people telling you what to get. If it resonates with you and the book seem like it's just not informative enough, too simple, you know, I don't give a damn what that bitch said, duck, duck, goose. If it resonates with you, it's your reference guide. Sometimes people be trying to be too deep and end up crossing you up and giving you some information in a book. You read it and it does nothing for you. Then you're out of money. You know, just trying to be deep. Send up with a reference book that you're never going to use. Or you got to give away. Or try to sell back to the bookstore. Or just keep and somebody find it, you know, in your garage. So I only get reference guides that esoteric reference guys that resonate with you personally and that can perfect your craft or your gift or whatever it is that you do keep shit simple simplify that's all i know and you can simplify with a big ass empire like jay-z and beyonce guy you really can and run it i mean remotely for real it don't take much Fifth dimension, we just be doing too much and then have to simplify, you know? Yeah, we up in some dimensions because I'm finna all kind of. Surviving isn't thriving. Somebody a Virgo. Mm hmm. Commitment. Yeah, y'all gonna get this. Somebody got this yesterday. Y'all gonna get this. Yeah, yeah. Bitch, don't kill my vibe. Somebody watching. So, bitch, don't kill. Don't kill nobody vibe that's on this frequency right now, please. Some of y'all need Reiki. I'm going to put my um, website in the description box below, but I only do distant Reiki. So, it works <laughs> if you're not in where I live at. I don't do in-house Reiki. I only do distant Reiki, and it works. You can go to my Facebook page and see my work everywhere. Fate, infinity, 
Okay, so some of us are trying, you really are. And some of y'all are gonna be in a twin flame million or you are in a twin flame million. Some of y'all just been crying and crying, trying to figure out should you be with this person? People that see a this and that about this energy, blasey skippy, it really doesn't matter. If you're healing, you're gonna be unlayering. I always think of an onion, it makes you cry. It's just what it is. You know, you just peel back, cry it out, go through it, peel back, cry it out, go through it. And if you look into your side and a person is still there, and they haven't done anything that's really irreparable. Because love can repair anything if you can go the distance. However, if you like, it's a difference between saying, come on, let's keep walking, baby. And if you do not get the fuck away from me, why, why do you keep on? It's not gold. It's over. You see? That's not the same. So you shouldn't listen to people. That's why you have to know what you, it don't matter what a motherfucker did. You can marry, you can't turn the home into a housewife. Yes, the fuck you can if you love that though. Beyond the grave. And when you love somebody beyond the grave, a lot of shit happens. But for you, that's somebody worth hurting for. You the one that got to deal with that person. Not nobody outside of that union, that loop. So it's somebody you want to be in that loop with. You feel like this towards energy. Some people may say, hey, you stupid for feeling like that. And I'm not talking about child grown-ups. No, I'm talking about the energy. That's just your boo. You know? Shit, bring it up. That's what people should learn they fucking bitch. Mm-hmm. Some of y'all being mentally strong and patient waiting on a twin flame because y'all can feel them. Y'all can feel them. Some of y'all are excited about what y'all feel. That's dope. I've been there. I've been there. You can feel them coming. I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh, Lord. I've been waiting for this moment for all my life. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Yeah, some of y'all are about to come into union. Reconnect, recommit, or first time meeting. And really everything is reconnection to me when you're a twin flame. You're just re-meeting on this timeline. Like, hey, damn, man, what took you so long? Fuck what's going on? Man, this happened, man. I was fighting zombies. They stabbed me up. I had to go to jail. Then I got out. It was some crazy shit happening over there on that timeline. Like, man, I told you. You gonna stay close to this time, ain't you? I bet you. That's how that's gonna go. That could be for some of y'all too. Somebody done went out and dated somebody or gave them some coochie and then tell you and you found out later and they end up being a crazy ass person. Like you gotta deal with that shit. Yeah. Some of the people some people take it so long because it's fear of the unknown. You ain't never been here before, but Go for it. That's what Spirit is saying. Take the leap. Because all you're leaving behind is doubt, trends, failure, grief, anger, toxic cycles, fake love, mind games, dead ends, betrayal, negative self-talk, restriction, victim mentality, lies, bad choices, pain, hurt. That's what you used to. That's the past, though. You you don't you like, damn, if I jump this way, shit over here. It's just peaceful. Really? Not all those fucking mountains? Well, what do you mean? Oh, I'm on dry land? I mean, I can walk like a regular? Be balanced? Okay, fine. I'll take the fucking leap. Your destiny awaits. Transmute the pain. Okay, so y'all about to have a financial windfall. If y'all looking for money, answers. It says, prepare for a financial windfall. It may appear after a tower moment in your life. Make sure to pay attention to windows of opportunity. They may shut as fast as they open. And I have been doing money rituals. So if you're subscribed to this channel, pay attention. Don't miss out on no opportunities. If you're new to the channel, please like, share, and subscribe if you feel the vibe. Yeah, transmute the pain into power. That's what some of y'all decided to do. Yeah, it feel better. Anyway, when you just decide to just oh, do this, oh, fuck what they did. It's a path. It doesn't matter. Keep rehashing it. Keep 
remasticating it. This is getting gross. I love you. We have chemistry. I want I want us to be a power couple. That's what I always seen for us. You had some issues. I've had some issues. Let's just keep on walking. Period. Yeah, dropping attachments. Absolutely. Use the logic of a Virgo. Let's see this back of this car says. <laughs> back of this car says use the logic of a Virgo. Yeah, some of y'all are having sex on uh, dimensions. Y'all just got a divine connection. You in this divine fam energy. If you're a male watching this. Mm -hmm. Y'all just a vibe. I mean, it is what it is. You just got to come together in the 3D. Because some of y'all and y'all are. Because you're just realizing it's stupid. Yeah. They know you're going to say yes if they ask to marry you. Yeah, it's just, it's just, just wait. It's, yeah. You already took the leap for real for some of y'all. was just even rationally wrestling with the fact some of y'all been in situations where you already knew i ain't fuck with this person just something to do you here for something to do okay you bored okay me too just here for something to do how you know y'all knew y'all wasn't doing shit with that but the fact that you was going back and forth and really thinking about it and you know whatever it takes it's a life it's a chemistry you like it you took the leap already now you just got to show yourself in a 3d it's shocking to leave a bunch of shit and then go into something that's nice, you know? It's like being in the ghetto all your life and then somebody saying, come on, I'm going to take you up here to the Hamptons. You're like, what? Okay. And you, and you know how to act, but you just stiff because you've been in the hood oh, that kind of shit, you know? But you know how to act once you get there, loosen up a little bit. The person that's taking you to the Hamptons know that. You know, <laughs> it's usually our shit, dog. I saw it in you. You just didn't see it in your side. <sighs> All right, Gemini. I pray this helps somebody. Love and light.